with Sens Forward Rourke Charche as we continue our exit interview series. Uh, thanks for taking a couple minutes. Uh, you're on there. It's good. Will. Perfect. Yeah, <laughs> that's great. Um, uh, how would you um, How would you characterize your season um, back again here in in Belleville? And I know you had a little bit of injury trouble uh, as well. But uh, how How was the year overall for you? Yeah, it was a lot of ups and downs for me. My, um, you know, uh, start of the year, I think. Uh, Went well. Uh, got got called up for the first time in a few years, so I was obviously pretty pretty excited about that. And then got injured and uh, came back down after that, and didn't last long before I got hurt again. And then was able to play here at the end. But yeah, there's you know not not a bad year for myself, but again, kind of a, kind of a wild year. Yeah, um, we uh, were talking to Dave Bell uh, about your recent success because you finished the season really strong offensively, and he he noted the fact that the injury bug tends to bite you and, and give you some trouble. Is that uh, you know frustrating to have to keep dealing with year after year? Yeah, I think it's it's super frustrating. You know, you're it, it's kind of a pecking order hockey, and you're always trying to climb it. And my whole career, you know, any any time I feel like I've started to climb up, I've kind of been knocked back down and. Um, yeah, it's been, I mean, all sorts of different injuries. So it's not, you know, one thing or the other. It's, it's out of my control, but it does start to wear on you for sure. And I mean, I've been through it enough at this point. I think, uh, I'm, I, I know I'm always going to bounce back, but it, it's really hard when, you know, it's such a, such a game of momentum and you kind of want to take it and run with it for, for a good long stretch. And I, I really just haven't been able to do that due to, uh, injuries, but, um, yeah, going to keep coming back, so we'll yeah. see what happens. Well, and uh, you mentioned obviously getting back to the NHL for uh, a little bit as well. How much did that kind of spur you on um, in in coming back to Belleville and and in getting through that injury? Just to kind of uh, I guess remind yourself that you're right there. Yeah, I think that that was big for me. Obviously, it'd been a few years. I, I'd sat out a couple of years, and then uh, there'd been a couple of seasons before I'd uh, got called up again. So. I was never sure if I was going to play, you know, in, in the top league again. So that, that meant a lot to me to get back up there. And again, another opportunity where I was hoping I could have run with it a bit further. But, yeah, you know, broke my wrist in the sixth game. So the way it goes. But no, that, that was a good feeling. You know, that's that's kind of why I play, I've always played the game. I've always, you know, wanted to play in the NHL. And that's been the dream of mine. So it was, it was nice to get another taste, but definitely uh, not satisfied. Uh, you were able to hit the uh, the 20 goal mark yesterday. Uh, what does that mean to you to to be able to to show that you can still be a marquee scorer in this league? Yeah, um, obviously it's nice to have some personal success offensively. Um, I I don't think too much about those things, but yeah, it was it was good to hit I guess 20 in the last game there, and it's all credit to my teammates, line mates, you know, getting me the puck in good spots, and yeah, it's a, it's always nice to have personal success too. Uh, what does your summer maybe look like? Are you, are you going to head back to Saskatoon and, and skate there? Yeah, I think I'll head back to Sask Saskatchewan. I don't have a real big plan. Obviously, I was hoping we'd be in it a bit longer, so I, I really uh, really haven't uh, planned that far ahead. So going to gonna finish up here, reset, and then uh, I imagine I'll be in Saskatoon, but haven't really decided yet. Uh, contract year, obviously. Um, uh, what's kind of the mindset as a veteran guy going into the summer and just knowing that that's one more thing you've got to kind of deal with here moving forward? Yeah, it's uncertainty, which which isn't always great, but I don't know. I don't have a you know a wife or family, so it may, maybe makes it a little easier on me. But at the same time, it, you know, it'd be nice to know where you're going next season. But just kind of got to take it day by day. Like I said, going to wrap things up here, spend some time with the guys, and then hopefully take a few trips somewhere and then um, yeah just get focused and you know that's my agent's job and see where the opportunity is for next year and uh, and go with it well uh, if it's here uh, fantastic if it's not it's been uh, great watching you play and uh, and following along for the ride so uh, thanks for for that and uh, and all the best through the summer shorts all right thanks guys